20 famous people you'd never recognize today. Welcome to our channel. Today we explore the captivating transformations of some of Hollywood's most iconic stars. From enduring elegance to groundbreaking roles, join us as we delve into the journeys of beloved celebrities. Now, let's get started. Meg Ryan Meg Ryan, born on November 19, 1961 in Fairfield, Connecticut, rose to fame in the 1980s and 1990s through her endearing performances in romantic comedies such as When Harry Met Sally and Sleepless in Seattle. These roles established her as America's sweetheart, known for her charming smile and girl-next-door appeal. Over the years, Ryan's appearance has undergone a noticeable transformation, marked by her decision to embrace a more natural aging process. Unlike some celebrities who opt for extensive cosmetic alterations, Ryan has chosen a path that reflects authenticity and self-acceptance. This decision has garnered mixed reactions from the public, with some applauding her choice and others expressing nostalgia for her earlier image. While the change in her physical appearance has sparked discussions, it seems to have had minimal impact on Meg Ryan's career. Despite taking a step back from leading roles, she remains a respected figure in the entertainment industry, occasionally taking on supporting roles and exploring opportunities behind the camera. Brigitte Nielsen Brigitte Nielsen, born on July 15, 1963, in Rodevre, Denmark, first gained widespread recognition in the 1980s for her striking looks and towering height. Her breakthrough roles in films like Red Sonja and Rocky IV solidified her status as an international sex symbol and action movie star. Over the years, Nielsen's appearance has undergone a remarkable transformation. Once known for her glamorous, statuesque beauty, she has embraced a more natural and authentic look as she aged. Nielsen's decision to embrace her changing appearance has been met with appreciation from fans and the public, who applaud her confidence and authenticity. Nielsen's bold transformation has not gone unnoticed, and the public's reaction has been generally positive. Fans admire her for breaking away from conventional beauty standards and embracing her natural self. This shift in her image has sparked discussions about ageism in the entertainment industry and has paved the way for a more inclusive definition of beauty. Kathleen Turner Kathleen Turner, born on June 19, 1954, in Springfield, Missouri, captivated audiences with her compelling performances and distinctive husky voice. Renowned for iconic roles in films such as Body Heat and Romancing the Stone, Turner's sultry presence became synonymous with 1980s Hollywood allure. In recent years, Turner's appearance has undergone a graceful transformation marked by the natural aging process. Her decision to embrace these changes has resonated positively with admirers who appreciate her authenticity. Despite the physical alterations, Turner's timeless talent continues to shine, transcending the superficial aspects of fame. Public reactions to Kathleen Turner's current appearance vary. While some celebrate her embracing authenticity, others may express nostalgia for her youthful on-screen image. Remarkably, her enduring talent has shielded her from any significant impact on her illustrious career, showcasing that true artistry surpasses external perceptions. Kelly McGillis Kelly McGillis, born on July 9, 1957 in Newport Beach, California, is an acclaimed actress known for her captivating performances in the 1980s and beyond. Her career took off with the iconic film Top Gun, 1986, where she starred alongside Tom Cruise, solidifying her status as a Hollywood leading lady. McGillis continued to make significant contributions to cinema with roles in movies like Witness, 1985, earning her a Golden Globe nomination, and The Accused, 1988. Her ability to portray a range of characters showcased her versatility and earned her critical acclaim. Over the years, Kelly McGillis has experienced changes in her appearance. 
but it's important to note that her journey wasn't solely about physical transformations. After achieving fame, she took a step back from the Hollywood spotlight, focusing on personal growth and leading a quieter life away from the industry. Public reactions to Kelly McGillis's evolving appearance have been mixed, with some expressing nostalgia for her earlier roles and others appreciating her commitment to authenticity. McGillis's decision to prioritize personal well-being over societal expectations reflects a resilience that extends beyond the realm of Hollywood glamour. Janice Dickinson Janice Dickinson, born on February 16, 1955, in Brooklyn, New York, earned her fame as a supermodel and later as a judge on America's Next Top Model. With a career that took off in the 1970s, she became known for her striking looks and fierce runway presence. Over the years, Dickinson's appearance has evolved, partly due to her openness about undergoing cosmetic procedures. While some fans admire her candidness, others express mixed reactions to the transformations. Dickinson's decision to embrace change reflects her perspective on beauty as a personal choice. Public responses to Janice Dickinson's current appearance vary. Some applaud her for being transparent about the influence of cosmetic enhancements, while others may feel nostalgic for her earlier image. Despite this, Dickinson's resilience and outspoken nature have maintained her presence in the media. Caitlyn Jenner Caitlyn Jenner, originally known as William Bruce Jenner, was born on October 28, 1949, in Mount Kisco, New York. Initially celebrated as an Olympic gold medalist in the decathlon, Jenner later underwent a highly publicized gender transition. Jenner's fame initially stemmed from her remarkable achievements in athletics, particularly winning the gold medal in the decathlon at the 1976 Summer Olympics in Montreal. However, it was in 2015 that Jenner publicly revealed her gender identity and introduced herself to the world as Caitlyn. The transformation in Caitlyn Jenner's appearance reflects her journey of self-discovery and living authentically. Her decision to embrace her true identity garnered significant attention and sparked important conversations about transgender visibility and acceptance. Public reactions to Caitlyn Jenner's transition have been diverse. While some applaud her courage and advocacy for transgender rights, others express varying opinions on her public persona and the intersection of identity and celebrity. Nonetheless, Caitlyn Jenner's transition has undeniably impacted her public image, both positively and controversially. Elsa Patton Elsa Patton, born on January 30, 1936, in Cuba, gained recognition as a reality television personality, particularly known for her appearance on the Bravo TV series The Real Housewives of Miami. Elsa brought a unique and vibrant energy to the show, captivating audiences with her charismatic personality. While Elsa Patton's early life and career details may not have been as widely documented as some other celebrities, her fame rose significantly due to her role as the mother of Mary Saul Patton, one of the main cast members on The Real Housewives of Miami. Over time, Elsa's appearance underwent changes, which she openly attributed to cosmetic enhancements. Her willingness to discuss these changes publicly reflected her candid and unapologetic attitude. Audiences generally responded positively to Elsa Patton's unique charm on reality television. Her witty remarks and bold personality made her a memorable figure among fans of the show. Despite the changes in her appearance, Patton's magnetic presence continued to leave an impact. Elsa Patton passed away in 2019 at the age of 83, leaving behind a legacy of charm and candidness. Congratulations on completing 1-3 of this exploration journey. If you enjoyed this video, please comment 1, otherwise comment 0. We will use this feedback to evaluate and improve our content. Thank you. Pamela Anderson Pamela Anderson, born on July 1, 1965,
1967, in Ladysmith, British Columbia, Canada, emerged as a cultural icon through her roles as an actress and model. Initially gaining fame as the Tool Time Girl on the sitcom Home Improvement, she later skyrocketed to global recognition as C.J. Parker on Baywatch. Anderson became synonymous with the epitome of 90s glamour. Anderson's beauty and alluring persona have been central to her fame. Her iconic portrayal of C.J. Parker, running in slow motion across the beach, left an indelible mark on popular culture. Her status as a Playboy Playmate further solidified her as a sex symbol, making her one of the most recognized and desired women in the world. Over the years, Pamela Anderson's appearance has evolved. While her youthful image persists in the collective memory, Anderson's willingness to embrace change has included updates to her iconic blonde look and, at times, public discussions about cosmetic procedures. Public reactions to Pamela Anderson's evolving appearance have been mixed, with some appreciating her adaptability and continued allure, while others express nostalgia for her earlier image. Amy Lee Amy Lee, born on December 13, 1981, in Riverside, California, is a renowned singer, songwriter, and pianist, best known as the co-founder and lead vocalist of the rock band Evanescence. Her ethereal voice and emotive lyrics have made her a captivating figure in the music industry. Lee's journey to fame began with the formation of Evanescence in the late 90s. The band's debut album, Fallen, released in 2003, featured the iconic hit Bring Me to Life, showcasing Lee's powerful vocals and establishing Evanescence as a prominent force in alternative rock. Known for her dark and mysterious stage presence, Amy Lee's appearance complements the gothic and symphonic elements of Evanescence's music. Despite the music industry's emphasis on image, Amy Lee's focus has always been on the artistry of her craft. Her authenticity and commitment to creating meaningful music have garnered widespread acclaim and a dedicated fan base. Audiences have reacted passionately to Lee's performances and the emotional depth in Evanescence's music. Mara Wilson Mara Wilson, born on July 24, 1987, in Los Angeles, California, rose to fame as a child actress in the 1990s, widely recognized for her roles in beloved films like Matilda and Mrs. Doubtfire. Wilson charmed audiences with her talent and undeniable charisma. Born into a showbiz family, Wilson's career began at an early age, and her performances showcased a natural and endearing quality. Her memorable portrayal of Matilda Wormwood in the film Matilda solidified her status as a talented child star. As Mara Wilson transitioned from child roles to adolescence, she chose a different path. Rather than continuing as a Hollywood star, she pursued higher education and explored her interests in writing and storytelling. Wilson's decision to step away from the spotlight showcased a level of maturity and autonomy uncommon among former child actors. Her appearance has naturally evolved over the years, reflecting her personal growth. Embracing authenticity, she has been open about her experiences in the entertainment industry, discussing both the positive and challenging aspects. Aubrey O'Day Aubrey O'Day, born on February 11, 1984, in San Francisco, California, is a multi-talented artist, singer, songwriter, and reality television personality. She gained prominence as a member of the girl group Danity Kane, formed on the reality show Making the Band. Known for her powerful vocals and dynamic stage presence, O'Day played a pivotal role in the success of Danity Kane. The group's debut album, Danity Kane, released in 2006, achieved significant commercial success, solidifying O'Day's status as a rising star in the music industry. Her journey extended beyond music into the realm of reality television, with appearances on shows like Celebrity Apprentice and Famously Single. Over the years, Aubrey O'Day's appearance has undergone transformations, and she has been open about her experiences with body image and self-acceptance. Despite the challenges, 
O'Day has maintained her confidence and individuality, becoming an advocate for body positivity. Tory Spelling Tori Spelling, born on May 16, 1973, in Los Angeles, California, is an actress, author, and television personality best known for her role as Donna Martin on the popular television series Beverly Hills 90210. Born into a Hollywood legacy as the daughter of famed producer Aaron Spelling, Tori began her journey in the entertainment industry at an early age. Her role in Beverly Hills 90210 significantly impacted 1990s pop culture, making her a household name. Despite the challenges associated with being the child of a Hollywood mogul, Tori Spelling carved her own path in the industry. Beyond acting, she explored various ventures, including reality television. Her participation in shows like Tori and Dean in Love provided audiences with a glimpse into her personal and professional life. Over the years, Spelling's appearance has garnered public attention. She has been open about her experiences with body image issues and the pressures of Hollywood standards. Despite the scrutiny, Spelling has maintained her individuality and resilience. Public reactions to Tori Spelling have been diverse, with fans appreciating her candidness and others expressing opinions on her public persona. Victoria Jackson Victoria Jackson, born on August 2, 1959, in Miami, Florida, is a multi-talented entertainer known for her contributions to comedy and her time on Saturday Night Live, SNL. Her full name, Victoria Jane Jackson, is associated with a career that extends beyond the realm of laughter into the spheres of activism and political engagement. Jackson's rise to fame began when she joined the cast of SNL in the 1980s. Her quirky characters and energetic performances made her a memorable figure on the show. Her stint on SNL provided a platform for her comedic talents and helped establish her as a recognizable face in the entertainment industry. Beyond her comedic pursuits, Victoria Jackson has delved into the world of activism. Over the years, she has become known for her conservative political views and her involvement in various causes. Her transition from comedy to political activism reflects her passionate commitment to her beliefs. Victoria Jackson's appearance has also evolved over time, and she has been open about her personal and political transformations. Her outspoken nature and willingness to express her views have sometimes sparked public debates, but she remains steadfast in her convictions. Public reactions to Victoria Jackson's post-SNL career have been diverse, with some appreciating her dedication to causes she believes in, while others have different opinions on her political stance. Kelly Osborne. Kelly Osborne, born on October 27, 1984, in London, England, is a multifaceted personality known for her contributions to the entertainment industry, fashion, and reality television. As the daughter of iconic rock star Ozzy Osborne, Kelly was introduced to the public eye at an early age. Her journey to fame reached new heights with her family's reality show, The Osbournes which premiered in the early 2000s. The show provided an inside look into the Osborne family dynamics, showcasing Kelly's bold and unapologetic personality. Her presence on the show endeared her to audiences worldwide. Beyond her reality TV stardom, Kelly Osborne has ventured into diverse fields. Her foray into the fashion world led to her becoming a style icon. Her distinctive looks and ever-evolving hairstyles have garnered attention and praise from the fashion community. Over the years, Kelly Osborne has undergone notable transformations in her appearance, all while embracing her individuality. Her openness about personal struggles, including her journey with weight and addiction, has made her a relatable figure for many. Avril Lavigne Avril Lavigne, born on September 27, 1984, in Belleville, Ontario, Canada, is a Canadian singer, songwriter, and actress who quickly became a symbol of rebelliousness and individuality in the pop-punk genre. 
her authentic and edgy persona resonated with a generation seeking an alternative to mainstream pop. Lavinia's journey to fame began with her debut album, Let Go, released in 2002, which featured hits like Complicated and Skater Boy. These songs solidified her place in the music industry and showcased her ability to blend punk elements with catchy melodies. Known for her distinctive style, including her trademark ties, tank tops, and skateboarding aesthetic, Levine's influence extended beyond music, making her a fashion icon as well. Over the years, Avril Levine's appearance and musical style have evolved. Her later albums, such as Under My Skin and The Best Damn Thing, explored different themes while maintaining her rebellious spirit. Despite facing health challenges, including Lyme disease, Levine has continued to produce music and connect with her fan base. Matthew Perry Matthew Perry, born on August 19, 1969, in Williamstown, Massachusetts, rose to prominence through his role as Chandler Bing in the beloved TV series Friends. Known for his impeccable comedic timing, Perry's charm became synonymous with the 90s sitcom era. In recent years, Matthew Perry's appearance has undergone changes primarily attributed to the natural aging process. While fans appreciate his matured look, there is a sentiment of nostalgia for his youthful days. Perry, however, embraces these changes with grace, emphasizing the importance of self-acceptance. Public reactions to Matthew Perry's current appearance vary. Some celebrate his authenticity, recognizing that true talent transcends physical changes. Perry's enduring success in the industry affirms that his skill and charisma continue to open doors to new opportunities. Keith Richards Keith Richards, born on December 18, 1943, in Dartford, Kent, England, is a legendary guitarist and songwriter best known as a founding member of the Rolling Stones. Richards' influential career spans decades, and his iconic riffs have left an indelible mark on the history of rock and roll. Over the years, Keith Richards' appearance has become synonymous with his rock and roll lifestyle. The natural aging process, combined with a life filled with music and excess, has left its mark on his rugged yet charismatic visage. Richard's distinctive look has become an integral part of his identity as a rock icon. Public reactions to Keith Richard's current appearance are diverse. Many fans celebrate his authenticity, appreciating the lived-in and authentic aura that accompanies his seasoned appearance. Richards' ability to embrace his age and wear it with pride resonates positively with those who admire his contribution to the world of music. Edward Furlong Edward Furlong, born on August 2, 1977, in Glendale, California, rose to fame at a young age with his portrayal of John Connor in the blockbuster film Terminator 2 Judgment Day, 1991. His performance earned him critical acclaim and marked the beginning of what promised to be a stellar career. Following Terminator 2, Furlong starred in notable films such as American History X, 1998, and Detroit Rock City, 1999, showcasing his versatility as an actor. Despite his early success, Furlong faced personal challenges, including struggles with substance abuse and legal issues, which took a toll on his career. Over the years, Furlong's appearance has undergone changes, and he faced public scrutiny as he navigated his personal battles. Despite these hurdles, some fans have remained supportive, expressing hope for his recovery and a potential resurgence in his acting career. Jonah Hill Jonah Hill, born on December 20, 1983, in Los Angeles, California, has traversed a remarkable journey in the entertainment industry, initially gaining fame through comedic roles in films like Superbad, 2007, and Knocked Up, 2007. Hill's distinctive humor and quirky characters made him a standout in the comedy genre. Hill's evolution goes beyond laughter as he ventured into more dramatic roles, notably in Moneyball, 2011, alongside Brad Pitt. 
This performance showcased his depth and versatility, earning him an Academy Award nomination. This transition marked a turning point in Hill's career, challenging perceptions and proving his prowess as a multifaceted actor. Accompanying his professional growth, Jonah Hill underwent a noticeable physical transformation, shedding weight and adopting a healthier lifestyle. This change, driven by a commitment to personal well-being, drew attention and admiration from fans and critics alike. Jake Lloyd Jake Lloyd, born on March 5, 1989 in Fort Collins, Colorado, made a significant impact on the cinematic world at a young age with his portrayal of young Anakin Skywalker in Star Wars Episode I, The Phantom Menace, 1999. His performance earned him widespread recognition and a place in the hearts of Star Wars fans worldwide. However, the immense popularity came at a price. The intense scrutiny and pressure on a young actor left a lasting impact on Lloyd. Following his role as Anakin Skywalker, Lloyd faced challenges in coping with the abrupt shift in his life and decided to step away from acting. Over the years, Lloyd's appearance has undergone changes as he sought a more private and balanced life. The public's reaction to Jake Lloyd's transformation has been a mix of curiosity and concern. Fans, while expressing nostalgia for his Star Wars days, have also shown empathy for the challenges he faced. The toll of early fame on Lloyd's life emphasizes the need for support and understanding within the entertainment industry. His decision to prioritize his well-being over fame reflects a mature approach to navigating the complexities of early stardom. Jake Lloyd's story serves as a reminder that behind the on-screen magic, young actors face unique struggles, highlighting the importance of compassion in the ever-evolving world of fame. Thank you all for being among those who stayed till the end of the video. Comment too so we can see you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the Famous People channel for more insightful content. We appreciate your participation and look forward to sharing more engaging stories with you in our upcoming videos. Goodbye.